Hello friends, I am Chirayu Joshi from Advanced Coding Channel and if you haven't subscribed my channel then please do subscribe. So let's begin. In this video I am going to show you Wi-Fi adapters which works perfectly with Kali Linux. Then I will also show you unboxing of Wi-Fi adapter which I have. As you might be aware that most of the Wi-Fi adapters available in the market are not compatible with Kali Linux. Only few of them are supported in Kali Linux and it depends upon the chipset of Wi-Fi adapter that it will work or not in Kali Linux. I will sort some Wi-Fi adapters on the basis of quality. By quality I mean the chipset used and speed of that Wi-Fi adapter. So let's begin with some of the best adapters followed by some mid-range adapters which are perfect for beginners. This is Alpha AWUS 036NH. It has Relink RT3070 chipset and its price range is nearly 7000 to 7500 rupees, which would nearly be 32 US dollars. I know that it may be quite high for you, but as a beginner, I suggest you to go with some mid range adapters. Once you become professional, move to this best quality adapters. This is Alpha AWUS 036NHA. Only difference between previous and this adapter is the chipset which is used. This adapter has Ethereos chipset. Its price range is nearly 5000 rupees, which is nearly 35 US dollars. This adapter is also used by many of the cyber security experts. This is TP-Link TLWN722N. But before describing about this adapter, I want to warn you that only its version 1 is compatible with Kali Linux. Some people say that they can run version 2 in Kali Linux by installing proper drivers, but I don't think so that it will work. To check it, I went to a shop in my city and there I saw that there are no official drivers from TP-Link for Kali Linux. And I am not sure whether its version 1 is available in India or not. Its price is nearly 13 to 14 US dollars, which is quite affordable. And if its version 1 is available in your country, then I would definitely suggest you to buy this. This is Leoxys HG150N. This is the Wi Fi adapter which I am using currently, and I personally feel that it is the best mid range Wi Fi adapter in India. It uses Relink RT5370 chipset and its price is nearly 750 to 800 rupees. If you are a beginner then I highly recommend you to buy this Wi-Fi adapter. Note that I am not getting paid by them or I am not advertising this product. But I am using this product since 4 to 5 months and it works perfectly till now. This is the last Wi-Fi adapter for this video. Its name is RTS. I don't know why this product has different names, but it basically uses Relink RT5370 chipset. I asked its seller whether it supports monitor mode and packet injection or not. The seller replied yes, but I also found many negative comments on it and so I thought to buy Leoxys. The price range of this product is between 350 to 400 rupees. I will put all links in description box so that you can check it if you want to buy them. Please comment in the comment box if you are using any adapters and give your review on it. And finally I will show you unboxing of this Leoxys 150N Wi-Fi adapter. These are some specifications of it. This is a Wi-Fi adapter. The best thing with it is that it comes with pre-installed drivers. So we don't need to use this CD for installing our drivers. Now I am inserting this Wi-Fi adapter into my laptop.
Now I am opening the terminal. Type IW config. So as you can see it is currently in managed mode and it is connected to, uh, to this device. So we want to change managed mode into monitor mode. So type hermon ng check kill. This will kill some processes which are unnecessary. Now start monitor mode. Now again type iwconfig to check whether our Wi-Fi adapter is in monitor mode or not. As you can see the name of our Wi-Fi the adapter is changed from WLAN0 to WN0 MON which means monitor and this is monitor mode and to check whether a monitor mode is working or not type the following command It will show you some Wi-Fi near your area. So as you can see it is working perfectly in Kali Linux. If you found this video to be helpful then hit that like button so that it can reach to others and please leave a comment if you already have bought any of these adapters so that we can get confirmed.